Okay, for today's lesson, we're going to talk about having balance on the left and the right side while you're playing. Um, probably the best compliment a drummer can get is somebody coming up to you asking if you're, they couldn't figure out if you're right-handed or left-handed. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to take a, a rhythm that's really hard for right-handers to do uh, left-handed, and that's the swing pattern. So the basic swing pattern that we're going to work on, let me do it first on the right side. I did that faster. It's like a, a three bar uh, phrase uh, and the swing is and that's something that's really hard for uh, right handers to do with the left hand. So I'm going to show you um, a process that I give my students and basically what we do is you kind of learn it like a linear type pattern on the snare drum. Um, so let me go over it with you. And the thing to remember is these are all left flams that I'm going to be doing. Okay? And if you don't know what a flam is, a flam is when both sticks come down, but a right flam, the left stick is down lower. And a left flam, it's the opposite. The right is down lower. They come down at the same time. Okay. So let me go over the pattern with you, and you learn this first again on the snare drum. Real slow. These are all eighth notes, but we're going to swing the eighth note. So that would be one. And then what you want to do is you want to get that worked up. And you want to keep working on it until it's just real natural for you. Okay, so when that gets uh, comfortable for you, then we can start throwing in the bass drum. Let me do it real slow. One. Faster. Okay, and then you can start working on it. And what you want to do is just take the left hand, put it on the cymbal. Let's try it. And uh, let's try it with the bass. Then I'm going to put the hi-hat on two and four. So just remember though, before you go to the cymbal, make sure that you've got that pattern down on the snare real well. Okay, so what I like to do is, and this really works on making sure that they're balanced on both sides, is starting off on the right side, and then doing a, like a two-bar uh, break, and then I go into the, the uh, pattern on the left side. And I can do that back and forth. And it's just a really good way of making sure that your left is balanced compared to the right. You get it. You want to get it so the left side sounds pretty much like the right. Okay, so I wouldn't go real fast at first. Make it nice and smooth.
once you get a good feel going slow, then you can uh, get it going faster.